Hi, my name is Megan Spring and I am an Alouette team leader and consultant for Mississippi Central. Pop-up shows have been a big part of my business growth. With just a few products on hand and a portable table, I pop up at schools, boutiques, and even restaurants. I want to talk to you a bit today about these pop-up shows and how they can help grow your business. The steps I will go over with you today will apply to consultants in their very first month of business or consultants that have been in the business for a long time. Let's go. Step one, scout out your location. Did you just move into a new area or would you like to get to know new people in the current community? Pop-up shows can help you generate new leads and customers and also a few recruits. Pop-ups can take place virtually anywhere, such as the gym, local schools, locally owned boutiques, and salons. The possibilities are endless. Make a list of possible locations that you would like to pop up at. I like to list them in categories. For example, if I'm ready to start popping up in a certain area, I'll pick a business category, say, hair salons, and then make a list of all the salons in that area. Having my list keeps me organized and on task and I build momentum and perfect my approach with each new salon I contact. Step two, sell the benefits. Local businesses typically will allow you to pop up at their store when you offer to promote their business on your social media pages or by doing giveaways while you're set up. Offering free makeup touch-ups at boutiques is appealing to store owners because it adds to their customer shopping experience. Teachers deserve to be pampered. Offer anti-aging hand treatments or hold giveaways for products and free facials. You can turn pop-up orders in as a show and offer someone the hostess benefits, whether it's the business owner or you draw from all the teachers who popped up for some pampering. This creates an added benefit and a little excitement. Step three, communication is key. What you do with your captive audience at the pop-up show is everything. Greet everyone who approaches your table warmly and with enthusiasm. Have a quick intro prepared to let them know what you're doing and what you can offer them. Demonstrate products either on the back of their hand, Enzyme Peel is great for this, or offer a quick makeup touch up, or both. Step four, collect attendees contact info by using ballots. Use the Alouette ballots located in resources in your flight portal to collect new leads information. These ballots have a spot for all contact information as well as gauging their interest in what you have to offer. The best way to have ballots filled out is by offering a product drawing. As you talk to each person at the pop-up, write down key conversation topics on each ballot to assist in your follow-up calls. This will make each conversation personal and less awkward. Step five, the follow-up. The fortune is in the follow-up here. Make it a point to contact each and every person who filled out a ballot within 48 hours of the pop-up. Thank them for attending, ask them how they enjoyed the service that you offered, and offer them the opportunity again to book a show on your calendar. Be sure at this point that they are also added to your Facebook VIP group and that they know that you are now their personal beauty consultant and happy to help them with any skincare or cosmetic needs that they may have in the future. Following these five easy steps is a sure way to help you grow your Alouette business. Good luck with your pop-up!